So I was bored one day and I thought, you know what would be funny? Um, if I created a Twitter bot that thanks people if you ask it to. I think, I think that could be a fun idea. So why not turn it into a video? And that's what I did. So I started off by searching on the internet how to connect Python to Twitter. And it wasn't very difficult actually. And it ended up being really easy. So that's what I did. And that's what you're seeing right now. I just import a, a library called Tweepy. And that's it. That's all I needed to do. The next thing I had to do is actually sign up for a new Twitter account and sign up for Twitter developer so I can actually get the API connected to the Twitter servers. And I'm doing that right now. Obviously, I'm not going to show you the actual process because I don't want you actually copying my actual keys and somehow getting into my Twitter account and then and then hacking my Twitter account and then killing me. After I realized that no one <laughs> of my actual subscribers really wants to hack into my Twitter account and kill me, I then went on to Google again and try to look for an API uh, to do a Google Drive and of course I found one on Google's actual website. Ahem. Why Why would I even try? Yeah, and then uh, I found some code on the internet and then I learned how the code works and then added it into my script as you can see on the screen right now. And once I actually wrote that code, I went on to the actual algorithm which worked out when uh, there was an update in the spreadsheet and I actually sent out the tweet when there was an update in the spreadsheet and because that took so long, I'll just speed lapse it and play some awesome music in the background. Haha, <laughs> enjoy. And please like and subscribe. Uh, yeah, I'll put it. So now I'm going to display how this thing works. So I made this quick uh, form and it will look much nicer by the time you guys actually get to it. And so will the Twitter profile. This is just quickly set up to see if everything works. So what this form is, it's just a normal form. And then it's actually shared with a spreadsheet inside my Google Drive where it records all the names in this column and the Python code just reads it. Um, if we go into here just to test it, I will literally just write Zoidrek, I'll submit it, and as you can see, it was added here. And now, just to t prove that there's no tweets right here, oh, literally no tweets. And now, if we just run the script, I also set the time to two seconds so that we're not here for 90 seconds while it's doing all its things. And then we just click F5 to run it. And as you can see, it told me that it thanked me. And if we actually do go into the internet right now and check it, reload the page. As you can see, it, it did in fact like me, uh, thank me, I mean. So let's just delete that tweet and we're just gonna go into here and close the code before it does anything bad. And I closed it. Yep, and that's basically how it works. Thank you guys for watching uh, this <laughs> short little video, I guess. I just thought it would be funny to make a, a bot that just thanks people when you ask it to. So if you would like to check it out, I'll drop a link to the actual Twitter account. Uh, on the Twitter account, you do have the link to the Google, uh, to the Google form. And I'll also add the Google form uh, in the description as well if you want to submit your own person that you want to thank. If you want to thank yourself, thank yourself. You're brilliant for actually sitting through and watching this video, so you do deserve it. Uh, I'll be making some changes to it to make it more efficient, improve it. And if I do anything big, I'll probably make a video about it if you guys want to. And another thing if you guys want to is I can make a video where I actually go over the code in a bit more depth than what I did in this video because I don't want to bore people that don't really care about programming who just wanted to see uh, the output of the bot. But yeah, my name is Zodra HD. Uh, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you want to, of course, but it'll help a lot. Bye-bye. Uh,